Hello and welcome everyone back to our Thunder Brigade campaign. So let's continue. Kelda, Moon of Terranor, Alador System, 0500 hours. Kelda could be called the gatekeeper of Earth headquarters on Terranor as it houses a battery of extremely powerful AST, anti-space traffic lasers, devised to stop enemy ships long before they reach the capital planet of the Earth Alliance in the system. A large part of the troops protecting the ASPs have been flown over to Care Fair 1 to help the local garrisons ponder what had actually hit them. In addition to the usual mass centurions and jeeps, only a couple of heavy HMV chiefs and XP tanks are reported to be left behind on the moon. Now would be the perfect time to take out these dreaded laser cannons. Your job is to destroy all AST installations on the moon. For that purpose, you have a platoon of four BCC-120 battle tanks and a D3 shredder placed under your command. The battle tanks are piloted by Lieutenants Landreth and me, Sergeant Kang and yourself. The shredder is flown by Captain Walslaw. You land south of the AST sites at a relatively safe distance for the transporter not to be discovered. Throughout the mission, you must make sure your transporter is unharmed or you'll be stuck on the moon. This time, protecting the spaceship will probably be the least of your concerns as the Earth forces will likely be too busy defending the ASTs to go looking for Alright, it's hiding time. Fire. And let's proceed now. So what we're gonna do is try and do what we did on Yes, hug the perimeter. And well, take our opponents out one by one. We only have for effective combat tanks, so ideally we do not want to engage large concentrations of enemy troops in one shot. So in the meantime, let's just proceed north. We'll get Copper Walls off to hit to this general position first. Because he's slow and if we are pushing in, I don't want him to push in with us But more of just follow up behind us instead We may not be stealth tanks but having our sensors set to passive Will still help a great deal in making sure we do not get detected Oh, what building is that? There's enough command center. That building needs to be destroyed. Nice. And let's back off. Because it looks like we have some centurions on our back. Keep backing off though. Come on. Back off. Don't really want to engage in a position whereby enemy tanks have the home ground advantage. But we have the home ground advantage is a different story, however. Let's see whether we can lay out any more things out of that base. Really? No?
Hold on. Let's get ready. Oh boy. Indeed, there's at least another tank here in our direction. We got quite a welcome party here. Let's back off, please. behind a mountain wait for everyone to reach 100 and we just zoom in and destroy the base we're gonna have to work very quickly to destroy the missile I mean the Weapons bunkers. Fire at will. Nice. I need him to attack the sensor tower. Ah, that's not a missile I wanted to use. Should have looked closer before firing. Oh no. Oh no. Ah no. That's, this is turning out to be a very bad firefight for us. Accidentally tapped out. Oh no. This is gonna be a very rough and tough fight. We need to remove guns out of here. To realistically send a chance here. Finally, that's one pin in the arse down. Nice. All with generally very few resistance. Not resistance, but very little damage to our own troops. 
and we've removed us heavy chieftain of the planet. Personally, I'll let the shredder do the job, so let's move our other tanks out of the way. Oh no! Where did you come from? Oh, God, I almost got obliterated by my own wingman. Nice. Fire at will. Let's move away and let the shredder do his job. Look at that powerful, powerful plasma cannon just firing away. I think giving time for other tanks to heal up. That's an northern base. Destroy it. We'll fly walls off over in that direction, general direction. Destination reached. We don't really want to take on that weapons bunker just yet unless we can fire it from a distance. Is there a sensor tower near here? Let's move walls off south. Ooh, an enemy tank depot. Come on. Come at me, I know you want to. Destination reached. Oop, indeed he does. He and a few more, more of his buddies. Oh boy, he's down. Let's give our squad some time to recover. Oh my word, he just took out my front armor plate in one shot, not an opponent out like. Any day of the week.
Another Centurion Come on, don't let him get away. Nice. Target destroyed. Returning to formation. I think we've wiped out most opposition from these three bases. There's another one over there. Jesus Christ, how many tank bases are there? Let's move away. Don't carefully got our shredder doing his job. I wonder how heavily guarded this base must have been in the past. To oh, let's get our men out of there. I don't want to see any cases of friendly fire. I'm pretty sure he can destroy the tank base before he can even destroy the sensor tower. Just kind of sad when you think about it. Target destroyed. Returning to formation. In fact, he'll probably destroy two, two entire bases before he can even touch. The sensor tower. Maybe not. Maybe so. We'll just see how fast this thing regenerates. The PCC has a weaker engine than its predecessor, so it might take a while, but it will happen. Nice. Oh, that's a whole mess. Nice.
I just want a shredder to come in and finish this building off. Oh, we ourselves. Quickly finish off the bunkers. Oh, that sucks. It's pretty unlucky for us to get that destroyed, but so be it. Fire at will. Oh my god. But now we can just safely Fire allow. Destroyed. I'll just shredder to finish our opponent the objective off. It's nice to do that we're leading from the front. Target destroyed. Returning to formation. Please finish off the sensor tower as well. Nice. Group fire. Kinda sucks that we're so slow now. But so be it. We still have our missiles to use. Uh, sensors are still working, which is a big plus. It's just kind of sad knowing that all of that is avoidable damage. Get all of them to work on the building. No weapons to attack building. That mean that also means they've used up just about all their missiles. Returning to formation. Returning to formation. Now let let us get ourselves out of here. Mission completed. Nice. So this mission completed simply because we wiped every single thing off this planet so there's no need for us to run back, which is nice.
alive, you have been awarded the Top Shot Combat Star. The AST cannons were rendered inoperable. The United System spaceships can come out of their hiding place behind Tirpe 2 and there is nothing to stop us from mounting a massive offensive against Earth headquarters on Terranor. Things seem to be falling into place. Back home, our boys have not just been sitting and fiddling their thumbs in their hideout either. Apparently they have stormed Yaz. Nice. We've gotten the Top Shot Combat Star which is, by looks of things, a very, very highly rated medal. Well, hope you guys have enjoyed this episode as much as I have. Leave a like if you like the video, subscribe if you want to see more, and put anything you want to say in the comments below. I'll see you guys next time, and until then, take care.